would say again that you know the good news is you know if we look at the genesis of all these laws they are all gdpr like um and what's good about them and uh while they all have uh, their differences um the moving parts are all similar so um, while it is a daunting task to map to the very specific requirements, at least uh, from a planning point of view, you are thinking about accommodating consumer rights. You're thinking about transparency. So giving the appropriate notice on your website, on your policies, uh, the policies on your website, uh, just in time notices on your mobile applications, for example. Um, you're thinking about uh, a consent where consent is required. Um, and how you collect and manage that consent. You're thinking about vendor accountability and putting contracts in front of your vendors now that obligate them to the same privacy and security things uh, that, you, uh, that you are obligated to, um, that you are doing things like uh, running uh, impact assessments against high risk, uh, or frankly, even your entire program, uh, data processing of, of information, particularly where it involves sensitive data uh, or employee data. Um, and if you start to line those things up now, um, regardless of what state law, um, uh, uh, you know, is presented to us in the future, um, uh, you have at least the moving parts in the right place uh, to be ready for the next law that comes into place.